Welcome to the Unknown World, our own version of the One State from the novel Wii. Here you can see we have three of the four of the houses, the glass houses where the people with the number names live and work and do all of their business. Right here you can see that everything is perfectly symmetrical. All the rooms are equal, the same, and well, this one, they're working harder than the other ones right here. So this house right here represents how the one state controls everyone. They can see like everyone from the outside and it shows how they control and manipulate everyone here. Next we have the the ancient house and the globe. This is where the this is where D503 and I330 came and reunited to see the outside of the one state they will go underground and they will secretly go outside Next we have the integral up here, the giant rocket, well let me get there because it's really high. And, and there we have D503 piloting the, the rocket, the integral, and there you can, you can see how the unknown world looks like all the houses all the crystals everywhere the mirrors okay now moving forward to the last three scenes of our midterm project we have the skull which kind of emblems the uh, in individuality of and the embodying of the um, resistance um, then we have the so here it is the skull not gonna lie Jose did a really good job so we have the green wall. Can you show the green wall? Right there. So basically the, the green wall represents an art artificial displays of life inside and outside of the one state. Um, it gives them an I ideal of <laughs> how different one side is from the other so now we're moving forward to the yellow posters so the yellow posters um, is the way that the Memphis um, recruit the people from the one states basically um, portrays uh, the resistance against obviously the one state um, and Jose and I decided to choose this scene because it gives uh, light of how the Memphis uh, recruited their individuals now to the last scene the gas chamber 
There we go. So first, oh, this is a gas chamber. Um, this is where the people set uh, or seat to see or oversee the executions. That's where the gas chambers supposedly is. This um, serve as a suppression of indiv individuality, um, and it serves as a tool to eliminate those who um, deviate from the norms and what the one state um, stand for. So a basic summary is by considering all of these things together, uh, we came to the analysis and um, an understanding about how powerful the complexity of control resistance and the relentless human quest for personal expression is. Um, and yeah, that's our little world. And we got me and Jose, AKA we created. <laughs> yeah, we created. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.